Weighing in at just under 4,900 pounds, this late model Gray Wolf 22 RR toy hauler just arrived here at Halet RV Brokers in Coldwater, Michigan. And the brokerage lot is located about a mile to the east of our main lot. And the address here is 683 East Chicago Road in Coldwater, Michigan. I realize I'm squatted down a little bit right now. I've got that early morning sun just killing the lens right now. So I had to get down a little bit lower, a little bit farther out of it. Um, that's the reason why we're uh, not at our normal angle here. Looks kind of cool, makes it look big. Um, let's go ahead and jump inside and see what uh, what we have with this guy. Jumping into the inside, you're going to see a large living slash toy space in here. First off, we've got this big Dometic two-way refrigerator. Large pantry right next to that. Plenty of storage for your food and other items. And then as I swing towards the back, you're going to see the ramp door is closed right now. Those are going to be your side rails you see on that. And you get this big party sofa with the middle table. The table's going to go down. That's going to become a large sleeping area if you need that for any additional guests. And right now I'm going to go ahead and show you what that all looks like opened up from the inside. So now from the back, I am going to show you sweeping towards the front. We got a nice little, I'd probably call it a helmet or gear rack up there. You know, that net is just going to hold everything in place. And then moving forward, you've got your kitchen area, microwave and cabinetry up above. You got your flush mount fury on cooktop down below. Nice big sink, residential style faucet. You're going to have your sink cover in there. That is a sealed edge countertop, so you're not going to have any kind of water issues or anything like that. Our cooktop even comes with a nice little oven, perfect for those chocolate chip cookies or frozen pizzas, whatever it is you're going to need. Cabinetry down below as well as a drawer, going to be good for all your cutlery, maybe a trash can, things like that. Nice little backsplash right here, you're going to see that's going to kind of just keep that area a little cleaner when you're cooking that bacon or something that's going to pop and sizzle a little bit. And then finally, right up here on top, you're going to have your entertainment system right there. It's going to be your Furion AM FM. has HDMI output, so that's going to be good going right to your television. Continuing to move forward, you're going to see that nice foot, foot flush toilet right there. And then that's going to be a second doorway. That's going to go directly into our master bedroom up in the front area. So some people really like having that dual access. Uh, being able to come just straight from the bedroom into the bathroom. Big medicine cabinet with a mirror. Nice single basin sink right here with a residential style faucet. Plenty of counter space right there. And you're also going to see that little bit of that backsplash continuing right in here in the restroom. Big cabinetry down below. That's going to be good for your additional toilet paper and other, you know, toiletries and things that you're going to need. And then as we swing over to this nice big corner shower, Again, I'm a huge fan of the glass enclosures, always have been. Uh, keeps all the water inside the shower, and unlike, you know, the curtains can sometimes get knocked out, and then before you know it, all of your water is all over the floor. That's, I mean, it's just a really nice big shower in there. And then finally, you're gonna see we have our big Max Air Style fan up here. That's gonna move a lot of air in and out of this unit for you. So, uh, you know, on those warmer days, you just crank that thing on, and it's going to suck a lot of hot air out of here. Jumping forward into that master bedroom, you're going to see nice bed right here in the middle. We're going to have a wardrobe on each side. Cabinetry across the top. Windows on both sides opposing, going to give you a nice breeze coming through on those, again, warmer days. Or you know what, I even like it on the fall days where you're kind of nice and snug in bed. And then you get the cool breeze coming through. Right next on our... Uh, Right next to our bed on our bedside uh, table area right there, you're going to see you're going to have your 110 as well as dual 12 volt USB outlets. We're going to have that on both sides of this unit. Our air conditioning and heat is ducted throughout the unit, including the bathroom and this room. Here's our other big window over here, large opposing window. And the reason why I have the shades pulled is, like I said, it's early morning. We've got some really strong sunlight beaming in and out of this. 
Underneath our bed, we're gonna have a lift up for additional storage down below there. On the outside here, we have a nice large storage unit that uh, you're gonna see some of the things that are included in this. Uh, that's gonna be hitching, some water hoses, uh, a few other nice little accessories, as well as a full RV cover. Uh, those covers are not cheap. Uh, they're a little bit on the pricey side. Uh, so that's just a fantastic feature to have included in this unit. Now you're going to see the sun really just starting to kill us right here. Uh, so I'm going to move pretty quickly on this side to get out of the way. Um, another nice little feature, they have this cover that goes over your power tongue jack. What that does, it keeps it out of the weather, the dust, the grime, the grit, everything when you're not using it keeps that power tongue jack, you know, working well and uh, free from debris. You're gonna have your dual 20 pound propane tanks, battery pack underneath there, and then coming along, I mean, you're just gonna see, this is just a nice, clean unit. Uh, very little use, was only used twice. Um, I'm not sure the story behind it, uh why this uh why this customer is needing to get rid of it um maybe we need some money for christmas i'm not sure uh maybe the wife's a little upset that he bought it and hasn't used it as much as he wanted to i don't know but uh i'm, I'm gonna say their loss is your gain this is a lightly used very very relatively new uh unit i mean this is just a fantastic thing let's go ahead and swing around the back here and show you what this great patio deck and everything looks like when it's all opened up. And check out the rear deck all set up. How fantastic is that? You got the cable system that's gonna hold the patio in place and then the flip up railings. Gonna keep the little ones, the puppies, anybody like that that needs to uh, not be leaving the premise uh, under control. Um, great place to put a couple of chairs, just kinda hang out. Maybe watch the stars if you're up at the dunes or somewhere sandy. This is always a nice feature to have because then you're not having to be out in the sand. Just a cool little addition. And then uh, you would uh, fold up the rails, detach the cables and put the ramp down on the ground to load and unload all of your cool toys. Taking a look at that cool ramp from the inside, you're gonna see just beyond our uh, big party patio couch area here there's that deck with the railing all the way around it and then just above those are going to be roll down screens so uh, on a nice cool evening just go ahead and roll those down zip it up down the middle it's going to keep your bugs and other uh mosquitoes and varmints and things like that out and allow the nice cool breeze in now that i've got it all closed back down i just wanted to show you the uh Furion backup camera prep there. Obviously a Fox Racing fan. Uh, originally sold by us, this unit uh, was originally a Halic unit back here on the consignment lot. Um, like I said before, this is just a very clean unit. Coming around on our door side, you're gonna see the big power awning. Lots of big windows, outside speakers. Underneath that awning, we're gonna have a USB, uh, not a USB, we're gonna have an LED light strip. We've got the uh, more ride solid steps right there. And I'm gonna kind of wrap it up right about here before I get into that sun too much. So again, if you're interested in this unit or anything else here on our brokerage lot, we are about a mile east of the main lot. The address is 683 East Chicago Road, US 12 in Coldwater, Michigan. This is Halet Auto and RV Brokerage. We've had so many broker units, we had to start a separate lot down the street. If you're looking to buy, sell, trade, whatever it is you may want, come give us a call. We'll see if we can get you set up in the right unit. I guarantee you we're gonna have it. So give our sales staff a call and let us get you started on your RV adventure.